ओके वे आता कि ने बात कंटिन नंबर ओके एंड होल नंबर इंटीग्रल्स सो सी द डेफिनेशन इन द फर्स्ट वीडियो दिस इज द सेकंड वीडियो द फर्स्ट डेफिनेशन द डेफिनेशन इज इन 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 बट आई कैन आई कैन से क्विकली The book is uh, the book is about uh, everything guide uh, to algebra. That's what they call it. So we have uh, the natural numbers or counting numbers. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, and then the whole number. You got the whole number when you add the zero. Zero, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay. Then the whole number are the negative. You got minus one, minus two, minus minus three, minus four is a negative, or plus one, plus two, plus four. So when you got negative and positive, so you got the integers. The whole number in the negative, you got the integers. Now, if you know, if you take, if when you take two integers, you put it in fraction. In fraction, you got the rational number, and you know the rational number. You can you can have the the opposite of it called irrational number. Okay, and all of them, you can. Put them not not like uh, mix them. You cannot mix rational and irrational. They are opposite. But you can put in a diagram called real numbers. So now we are talking the uh, integers in arithmetic. So you say two plus three equal five. We represented the three the two. The number two like that, one two. Go in that way, in a positive way, like in in that direction. Now we have to add the number three. You count three, but but you start with the two here. You start here, and then you count one two three. This is represent three. Now they line up together. They are on the same direction. Now you got five as answer. Two plus three equal five. That is in geometry. You have to represent those 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 integers. When you say two plus into parenthesis, parenthesis minus minus three. You are doing. You add. You are, you are going to add. So you got to represent, to represent the number two in that in that in that graphic in that diagram graphic. So two. You always have zero in the middle. Okay. Only one zero. So you got one two. You go on that way. This is two. But you now we have to add minus three. So you 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 start from the two because it's minus three you go in in opposite direction. So you count one two three. So this is the minus three. This is two. This is minus three. Minus the number three. Minus three. So now. You can see the difference. The zero and minus one is empty, right? That part is like when you make the the subtraction. So normally, you know that part is minus one, minus two, minus three. 
but you got to start from the number two to go that way the, the, in that direction the minus represents the direction you got to go and count three and count two so you you stop here and the difference you say this is an answer minus one and you can say also two are minus two give you one and then you can say also you you have to put the sign of the greatest number and uh, the second one example is almost the same plus five even though i don't put the plus here you, you have the plus no you have the plus on your head plus five plus mean adding the number minus two equal so you want to find that answer so you represented the five you start with the zero going going on that direction positive direction you count until five okay one two three four five plus one plus two plus three plus four plus five on that direction this is the number five now you're going to add minus two so you start with the five plus, because it's minus that meaning the direction the direction has changed the direction has changed you go that way so minus two you go you start with five on that day, five and then you go that way you count two and then you realize in the number five you got more you can count so you got one two three left and that three stay on the on that position positive on that on that direction still on that direction they don't go far away okay, that direction is a negative direction minus one minus two minus three minus four on the other side of zero but that side of zero the right side is the plus plus one plus two plus three plus two plus four plus five so going on that the opposite direction you got two now it remains three so three got to be on the positive side on that side so it's why you say plus to be so if you say if you want to go quickly five minus two equal three so you got to stick with the sign of the greatest number which is five so the answer is plus three okay so as a summary for English.